So I have this, the Tempur-Pedic mattress. Anybody have a Tempur-Pedic mattress? No? Don't get it. It's that, uh, that, that cloud, sleep on your cloud. Don't get it. It's, it's the, it is a bad thing bed, okay? And uh, that is an, a verb. Yes. Um, it's a bad f***ing bed. It's a brilliant bed. It makes your back feel lovely, but it's a bad f***ing bed. It's like, um, you know, it has that memory foam, which if there's one thing I don't want in a bed, it's a memory. And it just, what the memory foam does, it just sucks you into the bowels of the bed so that you have zero thrustability. It's like you're just, you're just on a lumpy mess. It's, you're just, you're having sex on a fat person. No, not with a fat person, that's fine. It's like you two on top of a fat person. You know, uh, your, your Merlot is totally undisturbed in the corner. You can hop around as much as you want. And it's, it's made, another th aspect that they try to sell you on, it's made by NASA scientists. You know, the people that f***ed up ice cream? Yeah, they made that. I, I, uh, I will often get questions after the show, oh, how do you keep your romance alive? Well, that's easy. I, I, I take it in the butt occasionally. <laughs> um, that's the trick. I know you're not looking to, you know, settle down. But when you do, you find that right guy, you're going to want to keep him. And you're going to have to put it up at Cooper. Because I know that you're, you're a single lady, but eventually, you know, there, there's been that knock at your back door, right? You know, like, hand <laughs> ground. And I get it, guys. I get it. The, but it's like the last hole, right? It's the final frontier, you know? Your butt is Alaska, and they all want to drill in your natural reserves. Everybody's penis is a Republican, even Nancy Pelosi's. And when you're married, anal sex is not just for Christmas anymore. It's like you know, or in my case, I'm married a Jew. That's Hanukkah. That's eight nights of fucking in a row. <laughs> so it's it's good to spread that out because Hanukkah is just too much. I call that the festival of wipes. <laughs> um, so I grab the mic stand. So in comedy speak, that either means I'm about to do a big anal sex act out or I'm leaving the stage. Um, <laughs> luckily for you, it's the latter. Um, because I, I, I'm, you know, I know what I'm doing and I know that if I'm, I'm gonna do anal sex material and go back to some other material, I'm gonna get a urinary tract infection. So I'm gonna leave you guys. You guys have been great. Thank you for listening. Bye. <laughs>